Welcome, everyone, to a matchup that spans the generations. An epic battle between the 2012 Team USA and the historic 1992 Dream Team, long considered the greatest team ever assembled. No question the young fellas will have their work cut out for them, but they've said themselves, this is a game they feel they'll win, much to the amusement, I might add, of the Dream Team. But tonight, all the talk, all the predictions go out the window. Tonight, we'll see for ourselves, right here on 2K Sports. Yeah, there is too much talent on both benches to see this game get too lopsided one way or the other. I mean, I expect it to come down to a few key possessions at the very end. So, with love on the bench, here's the five for Mike D'Antoni right now. Chris Paul is out there with Kobe, and it's Durant, and it's LeBron James, and it's Chandler in at the center. Some changes for the Dream Team. They've got Robinson. Bird out there with Barkley. And it's Michael Jordan. And it's Johnson in at the point guard position. Now here's Paul. Lock at six. Here's Durant. Good, and Paul gets the assist. Durant's got his team on the board to start the game for Team USA. Here's Jordan. Johnson outside. Over Paul. The 18-footer is right on the mark. 111 left in the first quarter. And let's get this update now from Doris Burke, who's across the way on the sideline. I briefly spoke with the home team's head coach. And my first question was, what's the plan against Kevin Durant? Probably the premier scorer in the entire league. He said, well, it starts with trying to keep the ball out of his hands. Because once he catches it, you're kind of at his mercy. Guys, Durant's so long, he can just shoot over the top. When he does get the ball, expect to see some double teams. Thank you, Doris. Here's Paul. After Magic Johnson's bucket, Durant, bird cover. And Durant, here we go. Out to Kobe. Tries to keep it alive. Jordan against Kobe. Jordan rejected by Kobe. And here's the fast break. Johnson against Paul. Back to LeBron. Paul outside. Over Johnson. Paul with the bucket. I'll tell you what, he's made more than a few of those in his career. Here's Jordan. Can't get it to go. So it's a tie game as we end the first. We'll take a quick break, then get you back to the action. And off we go. A close game now starting the second quarter. And looking at what we've seen so far from the Dream Team here, what are your thoughts, guys? I was impressed with their transition game, guys. They really got out and ran the lanes. Yeah, they did. I mean, no better way to get easy buckets than through fast breaks. And now let's check out the lineups courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up and ready to go. Here's the second quarter of play. And so in the game for Team USA. We've got Anthony. Kevin Love out there with LeBron James. Then there's Darren Williams. And it's Westbrook in at the two spot. Michael Jordan is checked in for the Dream Team. Johnson comes in for John Stockton. Team USA also making some changes. Kevin Durant's checked in for LeBron. And it's Harden in for Russell Westbrook. Johnson attacking. Down to five on the shot clock. It's a look. Good. He hits the jump shot. Johnson's got the opening field goal the second quarter for the Dream Team. Harden outside. Now the pass to Love. Dream Team with the rebound. Johnson outside. 105 left to play here in the second quarter. Malone, good. Wouldn't surprise me at all to see them break this game open. They are absolutely lighting it up. Well, it's like you used to be on occasion when you got in that zone. You can't miss out there, and that's what they're doing. Every shot they put up seems to go in. 
And if I'm on the other side, I'm wondering what the heck is going on here. That's good. Williams has got his first bucket in this one. That's an old-fashioned finish there, guys. Going to the finger roll to get the easy two. Johnson dishes to Jordan. Left side, Jordan. Malone, Ewing, sinks that one from the post. I'm sure they'd like to get more shots like that one. Second quarter of basketball, just over a minute and a half played. Williams passes to Durant. Shoots over Pippen. Shots good by Durant. His offensive game is so refined. Guys, extremely well developed in just about every aspect. Outside Jordan. Outside runner. And the basket good. From half court, no good. And we're through two here and a good one. Dream Team out in front, up by four. Twelve. We're going to step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after our halftime. And now, brought to you by Sprint. I hope your weekend's off to a great start this Saturday night. Thanks so much for tuning in. The Dream Team has the lead against Team USA. Offensively, they're making it look ridiculously easy. Everything's falling. The Magician playing well in the first half. He hasn't put up overwhelming numbers, but without him, where would they be so far in this one? And for Team USA, they've been really battling. And give them credit defensively, they're boxing out, controlling their defensive backboards. Kevin Durant has stood out in the early going, and Chris Paul's also been getting it done. That'll wrap things up for me here in the studio. Thanks so much. I'm Damon Bruce. Now let's get back out to Kevin Harlan for the second half of play. Here we go now, the start of the third quarter, welcoming you back in a closely contested first half so far. You gotta like what Magic Johnson has done in this game. That's well, been nothing but positive for this team, the way he's been really selective with his, with his shot making. Uh, he's been very unselfish. I think this has been an efficient performance for him. I agree with you, Steve. Very few questionable decisions, if any, from him, as he has always looked for the best shot every trip down the floor. I mean, I like the fact that he's judicious in his approach. They've got Michael Jordan. Barkley is out there with Robinson. Then it's Bird, and it's Johnson in at the one spot. That's the five for the Dream Team right now. Now here's Johnson. He's got six. The feed to Jordan. 17-foot shot on the way. Gets it to go. Jordan's got his second basket. And he will punish an opponent for giving him that much room for the mid-range. He'll hit that all day. Paul with the ball. And it's Johnson picking him up. Back to LeBron. Barkley's there. So the Dream Team ends up going with a new group. A big group substitution here for Team USA. Kevin Love's checked in for Chandler. Anthony comes in for Kevin Durant. Andre Iguodala. He's checked in for Kobe. And Russell Westbrook is subbed in for Chris Paul. And about a minute of action so far in the third quarter. Westbrook kicks to Love. And that comes off the assist by Russell Westbrook. Well, and you can't let them get deep position. Yeah, you got to do your work early here, Steven. You got to be physical with them. Back to Ewing. Kicks it to Stockton. To the inside, Drexler. He's covered by Iguodala. Offensive rebound, Malone. And you know that's going to be goaltending, guys. So that's a free basket right there. He almost got to that shot in time, but not quite. You can't touch the ball once it's on the way down. So the dream team going with almost an entirely new group here. Barkley is checked in for Ewing. Pippen comes in for Mullen. Michael Jordan is checked in for Clyde Drexler. And it's Johnson in for John Stockton. Tyson Chandler is checked in for Team USA. Paul comes in for Andre Iguodala. Here's LeBron. Good. They saw just a little bit of daylight. Went right to the rim. Over a minute and a half into the third quarter of action. Now Jordan. It's Pippen with a drive. Easy shot. Kicks it out to Johnson. Feeds to Jordan. He's covered by Westbrook. Fades back, and it goes out of bounds following the shot. Both teams deciding to change it up.
inside Williams to tie and he hits the jump shot it's all knotted up and we have seen the intensity pick up big time here in the second half well you can feel the desire from both teams that they really want to win this and so after three quarters of play and some great offensive output this one is tied and we're just moments away from the start of the fourth quarter stay with us Welcome back. Fourth quarter action starting up, and we're going to send it over to Doris Burke for the Sprite Uncontainable Game segment. Doris? Hi, Kev. For this home team tonight, it's been an uncontainable game from their backup power forward. He might not have been a starter in this one, but with the way he has played, you have to think he'll be on the floor when it comes to its conclusion. And, Doris, thank you. What a great performance indeed. Such a huge lift to your team when you can get this production from a reserve. Yeah, in my mind, Kevin, he's been the most valuable player of this game. And when you can say that about somebody coming off the bench, I mean, that, that just shows you the impact uh, that, that one person can have on this game. Well, like Kevin said, it is a huge lift. I mean, I think a performance like that coming from a sub really energizes everybody else. It's contagious. So with Anthony sitting on the bench, here's the five for Mike D'Antoni right now. Duran is out there with LeBron James. Then there's Iguodala. Then there's Kevin Love. And it's Paul in at point guard. Four on the clock. Malone. The shot from the low post is good. And now the crowd really getting into it. Listen to that. It is shaking in here, guys. Absolutely insane. Here's Paul. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws now for him. Yeah, he's a fantastic passer, particularly in transition or on alley-oops, Kevin. He's got a knack for putting the ball right on the rim and letting his teammates go and get it. And let's give him some more credit where more credit is due for his role as a team leader. I mean, he's somebody who brings out the best of his teammates whenever he's on the floor. them the lead. So both teams making some changes here. Second one is good. Being both at the line and it's a two-point ball game. It's just got such a smooth stroke, and it never changes, even in this kind of high-pressure situation. Johnson kicks to Jordan. Oh! oh are you kidding me? That was a power punch right there. Oh, great. Well, this fella can rise up there with the best of them. Just a crazy finish, guys. Now he's one of the few players with the athleticism to pull that off. Special thanks to Sprite for that sweet replay. One minute now into this fourth quarter. Kobe against Jordan. Here's Kobe. Money! Kobe has been sensational. Now here's Johnson. Barkley covered by LeBron. Elbow shot is on the way. It's rebounded by Durant. Well, you have to get a hand into his face because that's his range right there. LeBron with it. Outside, Kobe. Shot clock at six. Chandler kicks to Durant. Over Jordan. It's in! What a huge shot. That's what happens when you knock it down late. Two seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Nice D by Kobe. You see the defenders get out of his way a lot of times when he's on his way to the bucket, but not that time. And an intentional foul right there. Yeah, you got to freeze the clock. That's the enemy in this situation. A few misses at the line, and they're in good shape. And that puts them up by five. And the Dream Team making a change here. Yeah. 
And so both free throws are good. And it's a six-point ball game. Yeah, big-time free throws there. You can put this one in the books. Now a timeout called by the Dream Team. They're behind by six. 11 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Guys, your thoughts? Well, there's a little bit of time here to play with, so a three and a quick foul could make things interesting. Very much so. Either way you cut it, they're going to need a pair of threes and some help at the other end as well. Doris Burke has some information for us. Doris? Hi, guys. I got a chance to hear what the home team head coach was saying to his players. He told his guys, listen, we've got to make the most of every opportunity right now. We can win this game, but it's all about making every single possession count. Guys, we'll see if they can come back. And they stop the clock as soon as they can with the intentional foul. Drops the first one, and that puts them up by five. And so he drops them both. It's a six-point ball game. Now a timeout called by the Dream Team. They're losing by six. Six seconds left in the fourth. Six seconds left to play here in the fourth. It's good! Terrible defense for both teams. Just atrocious. Yeah, it's been awful, Steve. I don't know any other way to say it. I'm sure both teams will get an earful from their coach. So it's Team USA taking the win in a close one. It was tight, but they managed to come up with the win. You know, nobody wants to lose a close game, Kevin. It's much better to win those tight ones. Well, it's time to say so long. For Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and Doris Burke, this is Kevin Harlan, along with our 2K Sports Group, thanking you for tuning in. Now it's time to present our Jordan Player of the Game, Chris Paul.